Welcome back to our rich YouTube channel. Today we'll be learning how to make this pom decorative net. Some people call this called pom pom net. It's very useful, especially if you make ball dresses for both children and adults. You can use this to decorate them. And it's very simple to make it also. So we'll be learning how to do that in this DIY class. So to do that, you need your like a template. I'm using this carton uh, uh, carton to do my template. And then you need to have a round shape maybe a plate a thing like this or whatever it is that you wish to anything round that will give you a perfect circle shape okay so once you have this you place your your model what you're going to use to form your circle on your carton and then you draw a perfect circle like this once you draw a perfect circle and you open it you have something like this so once I have something like this now, I'm going to cut this out. Once you cut this out, you have something like this. So you like try to find the midpoint and then form a small circle on the midpoint like this. And once you form your small circle, you're going to cut through this circle. And to make this easy for us, we're going to cut it here first and just make like a simple cut here. And then this will give us access to cut round our small circle. So once you do this now, you are going to replicate this because you need two of these templates. Okay, so you have something like this. So once you have something like this, you cut another one exactly like this. So you just use this, place it on it and cut something like this again. Okay, so now I've cut this now and I have exactly two of this so now to do my pom pom i need uh, two nets or veil nets so in your choice of net don't take the ones that are too soft so that your net your design can stand well so i have this net now and this is about three inches in length so i just cut like this is by 60 and i cost like four of it so depending on how full you want your net to be that is the amount of net you cut but this is a 16 inches length and i cut four of this so now to form our design i'm going to take these two together these two templates that i have i'll take it together and then i'll pick one of my net and then i'll start wrapping it around this through this circle here i'll start wrapping it around so you, you passing it through that small these two this tiny space that you have is to help you to start passing it so i'll keep wrapping it like this around it i hope you understand what i'm doing it's very simple to make i'll keep wrapping it like this around it so now one has finished i'm through with one i'm just going to pick another one and where that one stopped i'll put this and then continue wrapping again so that is how i'm going to do it till i wrap the all four two nets that i cut around this template okay so this is almost finished also where it stops i'm going to pick another net and then i'll continue so the fullness you want to achieve depends on the amount of net that you are wrapping around this so i'll continue like that okay so now i've completely wrapped this around it and this is what we have this is the last one i'm just holding this with my hand remember we have two templates together here so now using my scissors i'll hold it together i'll take it together like this using my scissors i'm going to cut through it through the middle the, the middle of these two templates so i'm going to be cutting through the net like this you can see I'll keep cutting it and I'll go to the next section and then I'm going to cut it also so you cut it you cut the whole net like this and this is the last one so now I've successfully cut the net you can see it here and then on the other side so you will not release it yet I'm not going to release it yet now I'm going to take a tiny long net piece like this and then I'm going to, this long net is what I'm going to use to tie it. And to tie it, 
I'll pass it through, I'll try to open this into two a bit and then I'll slide it in between it and then pass it through it like this and then I'm going to tie it before I remove it. So. going to tie it like this once and then tie it again just so that I'll know that it's secure. Once I know that I've secured it, I'll safely remove my template and then I remove the other one. When you remove your template, if it's not too tight enough, you can tie it again and I'll cut out the rope. So you can tie this again if you want, but I think what I have is okay. So I'm just going to tie it once again. And then I'll cut this off. So once you cut it off, you arrange it. And then anyone that is sticking out that is not right with this, you try to trim it with your scissors so that you have something perfect. Okay. So you just trim it off so that you have an even number of nets together. And then your pom pom is ready. You can either tack this with needle and thread, or you use a glue, a fabric glue, to attach it to wherever you want your design to be. So now the size of this pom pom depends on the the size of your template also, because this is a tin of milo. Now this this is quite big. This is what this gave me. So if you use like this fishing line now as your template something like this it will give you something this small okay and then you can see that the fullness of this is more than this because here i you i wrapped more net so depending on the fullness that you are aiming to get it depends on the amount of net that you have to spare and the template that you're working with so you can see how simple it is to make these pom-pom nets So you can use this to decorate anywhere you want, neckline, hemline, or anywhere you want it to be. And then it can also come in any size that you want. Let us know if this tutorial has been helpful. See you in the next one. Bye.